Hello. See you again with Car Expert YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe to get the newest update of car reviews. The Toyota Camry is the Bud Light of family sedans, it's inoffensive, reliable, reasonably priced, and gets the job done. And much like that mainstream, low-calorie brew, the American public continues to purchase the Camry in droves. The Japanese family sedan has held the title of America's best-selling car for 14 years, and, as of this writing, the Camry is on track to once again wear the crown at the close of the 2016 calendar year. Still, even Anheuser-Busch offers a Tangier Bud Light Lime for those wanting to spice up their workaday suds. In the same vein, Toyota gives its customers the opportunity to ditch the Camry's ho-hum 2.5-liter four-cylinder base engine for a little additional flavor courtesy of a potent 3.5-liter V6, which powered our 2017 Toyota Camry XSE test car. Along with a luxury-oriented Camry XLE, the XSE is just one of two Camry models available with Toyota's Ben 6. Starting at $32,235, the V6 version is a $5,060 upgrade over the 2.5-liter XSE model and also gets LED headlights, a proximity key with push-button start, a power sunroof, power and heated front seats, dual-zone automatic climate control, and a 7.0-inch touchscreen multimedia system. The as tested figure of $34,195 attached to our test car also included the $750 advanced technology package, automated emergency braking, automatic high beam headlights, lane departure alert, and adaptive cruise control, which also requires a premium JBL audio system with navigation, $710, and blind spot monitoring with rear cross traffic alert, $500. Armed with 268 horsepower and 248 pounds to foot of torque, the Camry's V6 is stout, yet it makes less power and torque than six-cylinder competitors from Ford, Honda, and Volkswagen. We've recorded a 5.8 second 0 to 60 mile per hour time for a similar 2015 Camry XSE V6, which puts it in league with the Honda Accord V6, 5.8 seconds, and the Volkswagen Passat V6, 5.7 seconds. All three cars are naturally aspirated and front wheel drive, but our 2017 version needed 6.1 seconds to do the deed. That's still quick but it's a full second behind the 325 horsepower, twin-turbo all-wheel drive Ford Fusion Sport we recently tested. While the Camry V6 may not be the quickest family sedan available, it's plenty brisk for real-world driving. Thanks to a relatively svelte curb weight, our 3,478-pound test example weighed 650 pounds less than the Fusion Sport and a six-speed automatic transmission that's fairly eager to kick down, the Camry executed our 50 to 70 mile per hour passing test in 3.9 seconds, 0.3 second quicker than the Accord and 0.1 second quicker than the Passat. More impressive, though, was the V6S fuel efficiency. Rated at 21 miles per gallon city and 30 miles per gallon highway, the Toyota returned 25 miles per gallon overall which is one mile per gallon better than the EPA's combined rating. The Camry also annihilated its EPA highway figure with a 35 mile per gallon run on our 200 mile, 75 mile per hour highway loop, a feat that's as much a credit to the Camry's well-tuned powertrain as it is to the car's 0.28 drag coefficient. Wrapping around XSE specific 10 spoke, 18-inch wheels, our test car's Bridgestone Terenza EL400 O2 all-season tires also aided fuel economy but did not generate much in the way of dry grip. Around the skid pad the Camry squealed mercilessly to the tune of 0.79 grams, a surprisingly low figure given that the XSE is the Camry sportiest trim level and is fitted with stiffer suspension pieces, extra bracing, and aggressive bodywork. A stiff ride and numb, heavy steering further added to our subjective frustrations. 
What's more, a 70 mile per hour to zero stopping distance of 189 feet didn't just trail competitors such as the Fusion Sport, 178 feet, Accord V6, 176 feet, and Passat V6, 170 feet. It also lagged behind the 187 foot distance we recorded from the 1,279 pound heavier Toyota 4Runner. Once again, our 2015 Camry XSC V6 performed better, coming to a halt in 178 feet. Credit is likely due to the Michelin Primus EMXM4 tires on the 2015 XSE. The XSE also has the unexciting but appealing qualities that continue to bolster the Camry success. A low belt line provides fantastic outward visibility from behind the three-spoke steering wheel, while an ergonomic if over-styled dashboard includes a standard inductive charging pad for compatible smartphones, a number of deep storage nooks, and easy-to-use back-end multimedia controls. Specific to the XSER seats and door panels partially covered in foot weight, it also has a pair of steering wheel mounted paddle shifters like those in the lower level Camry SE. As in Camry's past, the trunk is quite roomy and the back seat is among the largest in the midsize sedan class and has plenty of space for stretching out. As is the case with Bud Light Line, the 2017 Toyota Camry XSE V6 is surrounded by a number of equally competent and more engaging alternatives. Nevertheless, if forced to choose between bland and somewhat zesty, we favor the latter almost every time. Sure, it's no Jack Sabby brewing Hoffonius Union, but the XSE V6 indeed brings some flavor to the Camry's table.